the national accounts have come out today showing better than expected GDP growth, 0.5% uh, for the last quarter, uh, and year-on-year -year growth of 2.2%. So the economy is growing. Uh, we are working hard to put Australians first, to support communities in need, and of course, to deal with a very significant issue at a, in, uh, in our community at the moment, and that is, of course, the coronavirus. OK, you mentioned the economy in the figures today, but the Treasurer can't guarantee that the economy is back in the black anymore, can he? I mean, he's using the language of back on track, but we don't actually uh, know if, if a surplus will be delivered, even though it was promised. Well, I tell you what we're not going to do, Patricia. We're not going to mislead the Australian people. Uh, clearly, um, the budget was back in balance, and today uh, the Treasurer has made very clear that he will be receiving a briefing from the International Monetary Fund tonight. Treasury is doing further analysis, and that analysis will be made public tomorrow. So uh, there is no doubt that there are some very significant challenges with the budget. Uh, we are not going to mislead Australians like what Labor did when they were in government. Uh, but we are working very, very hard and the fundamentals of our budget are very strong and that's because we as a government have spent so much time and effort in ensuring that our budget remains strong and uh, that we make the right decisions uh, for the benefit of the Australian people.